Mode set. Executing. What's up, gamers? It's your boy CDROM 1019. Welcome back to Sonic and the Black Knight. All right, so we're hip deep into the three tests that the Lady of the Lake gave us, and uh, there is a child that we met that told us a dragon took his entire family away. We need to make our way to that dragon. So, first mission in the Titanic plane. Let's head for the goal. Whoop, forgot about this guy. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> Alright, that's bound to happen sometimes. I think that I can soul surge my way past these. Well, most of them. Grab this fairy. There we go. Well, isn't this a nice view? It's great. He's got a big weapon, but if he doesn't, he might try to grab you too. That happens when I try to get past them. I'm not trying to do that, but all right. What am I slashing at? All right, there we go. I think I wasted my soul surge. All right, and up this we go. So you'll probably, you've probably already noticed that Sonic's like got this little speed boost thing going on when he jumps, and uh, I haven't equipped any skills like I have in the previous game. So I think um, in in Black Knight that this happens a little more automatically. The game will kind of just like give you more skills, and you won't have to equip them or unequip them. Come on. Whoops. Oh, yeah, I was supposed to jump in the... Back up here. Back up. There we go. Movement in this game is a lot easier. Whoop. I don't want to soul surge too much when there's a bunch of enemies nearby. I kind of want to soul surge a little more when it's, uh... When I'm in long spans of, uh... Any mis uh, areas without enemies. Like, whoop, that would have been a good place, but I didn't have any anything in the Soul Surge gauge. There we go. New mission, Titanic Plane. New movie available. Ooh. Hoo hoo. All right. Some of these are nice. <clears throat> All right, and second boss, Sir Gawain. I don't suppose you're going to let me by. Ha! You look just like this knucklehead I know. Ho! You dare mock Sir Gawain, Knight of the Round Table? An act most unwise, my friend. Wait, wait. I'm not trying to pick a fight with you. I was heading to a cave to save some people from a dragon. Ah, you cannot fool me with your lies. No doubt you're after the dragon's treasure. Oh, man. You sound just like that knucklehead, too. You have defied King Arthur. This place shall be your grave. So, Sir Gawain isn't taking any of our uh, explanations, so we're going to have to put him down. He's not that bright, though. He'll get a few hits in on us, but he's already down. Piece of cake. 
new character available and a new movie acquired. To lose to a mere apprentice, I have been disgraced. Only death can remove this stain upon my honor. Give me a break. What's up with all this drama? Silence! Silence, I say! A knight who fails their king is unfit to live. Isn't there more to being a knight than just serving a king? Huh? I'm out of here. People to save, you know. All right, that's two of the three knights down. More to do. All right, so that's a perfect hit tutorial. We don't need to waste our time with that. The crystal cave is unlocked. Let's reach the goal. Yeah. Was that kid talking about the area up ahead? Yes, indeed. And it appears the dragon is We're gonna hit these uh, these crystals for some rings. I'm not really gonna go out of my way to um, talk to the village people unless I need to. Uh, it's That's more just for the item codex, which I'm not really concerned about. Alright, yeah, whatever, Caliburn. I don't see you with legs. I doubt you could do better on your own. Okay, now we're here. Alright, what's going on? There we go. Bats. <laughs> this corner pole is automatic, but it's really cool because it'll just give you a score bonus for that. Up we go. Soul Surge. Alright, whatever. <laughs> Big guy was in our way, but we took care of him. <clears throat> and there's the goal. Okay, so, mission's over. Let's, uh, go into the next mission to save the townspeople from the dragon. I believe this mission works on a lap system. There's, uh, we've got to rescue townspeople from these dragon eggs, I think. And, uh, there's a couple forks in the road, so we're gonna have to lap this once or twice. Yep, there's the one of the forks right there. And there's one, the first egg, or black onyx. So we stand in the light here. Okay. That's one townsperson saved. 
Here's another one. That's two. There's a third. Okay, I have to go and break these rocks first and then back step. Okay, I can't move the sword that well from there. Okay, there we go. That's three. There's the fourth one. Come on. There we go. Alright, that's four. There's one left. Oop. Alright. Okay, so we've lapped, so now I'm gonna veer to the right here. And there's the fifth onyx. Come on. There we go. That's the mission. Just made it. <coughs> New mission in the Crystal Cave. Alright, let's go on a rampage. It appears they have prepared a little welcome. Back up. Whoopsie. Gotta defeat a bunch of enemies here, so that's where I'm keeping my eyes open for. Oh, sorry guys. I didn't even swing my sword. Okay. Four. And three more to go. And that's enough. Oh, I need to be careful. I'm hurting the townsfolk. And that's it. Specialty title added. The appointed time has passed. Yeah, don't remind me. You've been waiting here the whole time? Sorry about that. Good news, everyone's safe. Thank you. And sorry about tricking you. Huh? You have shown courage, strength, and compassion. Huh? Then... I shall show you how to blunt the power of Excalibur. Cause you're a true knight. Yes! I see. So I have to defeat the Knights of the Round Table? And collect the Sacred Swords? Yes. The three sacred swords, combined with your Caliburn, should dispel the power of immortality that protects him. Sounds like a walk in the park. We'll see about that. Hey, come on! Isn't it about time you gave me a little credit? The remaining knight, Percival, is the Knight of the Grail. She's as strong as she is noble. One mistake could be your last. Don't worry! I've got one of the great sacred swords. Of, of course. It's about time you figured that out. I'm gonna make this look easy. She won't know what hit her. 
I've gotten pretty used to you, too. That is exactly what I told you not to do. Fare thee well, brave knight. Chosen one of Caliburn. So, very, very fortunately for us, that, uh... <clears throat> that uh, little kid happened to be the Lady of the Lake, who was testing us, and because we've uh, solved, because we uh, passed her test, she named us a knight. Also, very fortunately, is that the only way to blunt the, the scabbard, uh, or the immortality that the scabbard provides to King Arthur, is to collect the sacred swords of the Knights of the Round Table, and we've already defeated two of them. So, we need to find the third. Uh, so, next we go to the Molten Mine and reach the goal. Whoops. Oh, spikes. Not much foothold here. Better take it slow. Oh, all right. Lost my footing somehow. Gotta be careful. I guess that'll just happen to Sonic sometimes. Oh, come on now. Oh. Thicker block. There we go. Excuse me, sir. Whoop. I don't know why I jumped off the rail, but okay. Oh, wow. All right. Here we go again. Checkpoint. All right. I didn't jump dash, so that's my fault. Oh, okay. I can, I can guard while grinding. I didn't know that. Please try not to make a mess. Sure, whatever you say. Look out! Oh, forgot that that'll happen too. More spikes. Okay, more grinding. Oop. I think I jumped. Yeah, I jumped way too early. <laughs> All right. I don't know why I couldn't jump dash. Get off the rail. There we go. All right. That makes sense. I gotta be careful, I don't have a lot of rings. Split it in two with a jumping slash. There we go. Okay, get some rings. Watch out for the fire. All right, so yeah, I probably am getting a little cocky here. Okay. Go over there. There you go. Ah. Okay, yep, that was a bad idea. <laughs> Watch out for the spikes, and then the lava. Alright, I, I kind of had to move there or else I was going to get uh, hit by the spikes. There's our goal. Ugh, not good, but whatever, we made it through.
<clears throat> All right, defeat Sir Percival. And that's how we got the names Knight of the Wind. Alright, time to take down Percival. Oop. So Percival's a little different. Oop. Should have held my guard. We can still get some hits in, but Percival kind of hits back, so. Oh, turn around. Yeah, all right. Oh, whatever. Whoops. Accidentally hit the start button there. Alright, this might take me a few attempts. Why wasn't... She has really weird invincibility frames. Yeah. Oh, why? Alright, I might have to take a little more defensive approach here. Alright, see, that I don't understand, because I, I was shaking the Wiimote at the right time. I don't understand why that happens. That... There's a few gimmicks in this game that, that don't really make a whole lot of sense. Yeah, this is going to be a reset. She's just got this... <laughs> she's just got really weird invincibility. Come on. Oh, okay. I did one clash. Uh... Oh, all right. Got her. All right, that went very poorly, but we got it. <laughs> Close. 
close. Why? Why did you? I guess you could say that Wim is my other master. Save the hugs and kisses for later. What? You jealous or something? For a knave such as you? Ridiculous. Enough of that knave stuff already. Hmm. Actually. Yes? Sonic the Hedgehog. You have mastered the code of chivalry from this day forth. You shall be Sir Sonic, Knight of the Wind. Transpired in my reflecting pool. I have no words to thank you for all you have done. Yeah, but it's not over yet. Sir Sonic is right. We must still defeat King Arthur. The king is on an island known as Avalon. have become a fine knight. Ah, oh, cut it out. Anyway, I guess I'll go end this thing then. Good luck, Sir Sonic. I'll await you at Castle Camelot. All right, with Percival defeated, we now have everything we need to uh, take down King Arthur. So, let's head over to Faraway Avalon and defeat him. Take him down. <coughs> I'm Sonic the Hedgehog, Knight of the Wind. Let's settle this once and for all, King Arthur. It seems your impersonation of a knight has improved somewhat. I have you to thank for that. Then let us have another look at that unsightly swordsman. You're gonna be sorry you asked. This is it, old pal. Indeed. Give it everything you have. Only then will you prevail. Then bring it on, King Arthur! Okay, so this fight is going to use uh, the same, some of the same tactics, and then we'll have to hit him with a Soul Surge. But uh, if we time our perfect hits correctly, we can actually take this down pretty quick. Alright, I gotta make sure I don't get too far away from him. And I can s send these back at him. And then Soul Surge him. Oh, wait, no, I have to wait for him to do this attack first. I'll never finish him off unless I get in closer. There we go. Well, I got one perfect hit on that, and I couldn't get the rest of them to stack up, so. Whoops, I got paralyzed. It's harder than it looks. <clears throat> Alright, so that one, that third one's a little faster. Whiff. Alright, I, so that was actually my fault. I ran out of, uh, I ran so long that I ran out of Soul Surge Gauge. Quickly. 
Come on. There we go. Alright, and that's it. We've defeated King Arthur. Uh, King Arthur's down and the credits roll, uh, but there's still some more to do, so why don't uh, the credits are going to roll here and we can't skip them. Why don't you come back later? Okay, we're back. We got some new things unlocked. And, uh, let's go back into the things, uh, we got a new area, the Knight's Passage. And, uh, well, that's honestly probably enough for today. Uh, so, when we come back, we're gonna take a look into what's happening around the kingdom now. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Make sure you check out the rest of the videos on the GSL YouTube channel. Check out officialytr.com slash forums for more fun. And myself at twitch.tv slash chaoscontrolchannel. Till next week, folks. See you later.